YouTube. Guess who's back? I ain't gonna lie, I'm really tired. Um, my funk ass job moved me to the night shift. Been working from three to 12, sometimes even two o'clock in the morning. Been doing that all week this week for some reason. And it's been kicking my ass, but today I got off, it's Saturday. I know we don't have Saturdays off. Kind of 8, 42, I'm thinking some breakfast from Chick-fil-A. Gonna get some grubs, and then afterwards I gotta go to um, gym. I really don't have anything else really to say. My mind's still scrambling, trying to function correctly. I'll think it's food, and then head to the gym, and then we'll just take it from there. Why she, I know she worked at Chick-fil-A, but why she just, I ain't never, I ain't even gonna, I ain't even gonna talk about it. Yeah, I'm lucky late. I'm trying to get this food and shit. Should've known Chick-fil-A, my arms are like this, but I'm already here. And I'm gonna go ahead and get this work in, so. I'm gonna do that one. When I tell y'all that workout was crazy, bruh, it was stupid, bruh. My man's beat, you see the shirt? But now I'm finna head to the crib, take a shower, get my day going. Y'all remember when I said, about some Chick-fil-A? In the hash brown, bro? If you're from Texas, bruh, if you're from Texas, I'm not sure if they sell this all the way through the South, but if you're from Texas, you gotta drink this. You gotta drink, bro. The best drink you will ever touch to your taste buds. I don't know, I was getting out with that one. So fucking hungry, bro. Have you ever been so hungry that like, you be eating messy? I don't know what my face looks like, but this is good bro. Fuck! All right, y'all, so, so tomorrow is Mother's Day and still haven't gotten a gift yet because I'm broke. So I'm going to find the most cliche, subtle gifts that I can find, but I can't do anything without This is literally, it's just insane, bro. All right, so if there's one thing that my mom likes the most are purses or any type of like accessories, but this is not the buddy section because this stuff right here, all of this, definitely not her style. I think I might've clutched out with this one though. Take a look. I'm kinda nervous, but f it, we ball. I'm not finna go out here and just window shop like that. Like what? Not from my mom. So I'm gonna probably get that and I already have I already have no money. So that's probably the only thing she's gonna get for Mother's Day. Mom, if you're listening, I'm sorry. I could have did a lot more, but it's another situation. So but yeah, I'm headed to the main event, the reason why I'm vlogging to begin with. Stay tuned. <laughs> Alright, so now it's the bowling alley. Well, now, what were you saying about me? So, what I'm saying about you is you're the worst at making plans. What did I do? And apparently, you didn't tell Nick about going to see Dr. Strange after bowling. All right, I got receipts. <laughs> I got receipts. What's your excuse? I don't think I told Nick, but I definitely told Isaiah about it, though. Because no, Nick no, Nick wanted to go no, to Tino's. You, you, didn't, you didn't tell him about it. He overheard it when we were talking outside of work. Oh, my God. Well, I apologize. That's what I'm going to say. Is that what you want me to say? I, I apologize. No, I, I, I just don't want you setting plans. You don't want me setting up plans? No. But look who's here. Look who's here. The three. I did not raise my case at all. Did not raise my case. Yeah. All right, y'all. So we think it started in this hole. It's going to be three teams. I'm going to show you the end results after this. Go 
Those are the end scores, bro. So right now, what we're finna do is we're gonna head to Tino's, tacos, get my mans, get some grub, bro. You know, put them on some real good tacos. I'm holding it to a high standards because, I don't know, Ruby's is kind of hard to beat. Yeah, Ruby's, Maria. Ruby's, the yeah. Maria's. Is really good. Yeah, so we're finna head to Tino's, which is one of the best taco spots in town, and I'll see y'all there. All right, so change of plans. Tino's was closed. I thought they were supposed to be open at 10, but they're BSing. So now we're at Wingstop right now, and then afterwards, we're finna watch this movie. First yeah, y'all. I'm like real terrible at vlogging, but yeah, we just came from Wingstop. This is my first meal since the Chick Fil A that I show y'all guys. I'm finna go watch one of my favorite characters from Marvel, Doctor Strange Two. I don't know what to expect. I heard many reviews, many results. People are getting it, giving it like nine. The lowest is, is is a nine, which is insane to me. And it's only two hours long. So yeah, I'm finna go meet up with one of my homeboys, and we're finna, you know, catch the film. We're in the theater right now. Bro, I'm like shaking because this bro, dude. Where's the other one? I'm shaking, bro. We finna watch the movie, bro. The, the nice thing about IMAX, like imagine the screen, but two of them stacked on each other and longer. Yeah, it's and, it's and then, then the surround sound, bro. They got the speakers all up on the on the roof and on the sides, and then the projector that you. I've already got your like understanding of it. I want to see what you think about what, what you gonna think gonna happen in this movie. In this movie, it's gonna be crazy, bro. I don't know. Right. Look, I don't know, bro. Let, let me tell you, I've already seen it twice, and even this third time, I'm still excited about it, bro. This movie is insane. <laughs> I'm ready for it. I don't even know what to say, what to think. Just know that I'm, I'm ready. Get some sleep, bro. Great what films, great films, great oh, films. Yeah. Oh, you could come with me anyway. Uh, yeah, yeah, in the same direction. You're right beside me. But yeah, I don't know what I just saw. I just know that this movie was a 10 out of 10. If you guys don't know who Doctor Strange is or anything about Marvel, you got to get into it, bro. Got to. Because this this movie, this movie is probably one of the greatest movies I've ever seen when it comes to action. Just, just everything about it, bro. It's just, I, I really have no words. Cinematography. Just, just script. everything. Script, everything. the plot. From start to finish, bro, it's just like you'll be sitting there just confused, like just looking at the screen. Like you, it, it, it was insane, bro. Insane. Insane. Marvel, we need more of these movies, like for real. At least like a couple of them, not too Marvel many. And Sam Raimi were in their bag, bro. In the, in the bag, bro. They were going. If you got little kids, you probably don't want to bring them. To yeah, if you got kids or like anybody like this below, like maybe like eight years old or something, you, you can't bring them to this movie because this movie right here will do something to their dreams, bro. Like for real, like I can't even I can't even explain it. That's how that's how great the movie was. But yeah, it's been your boy. It's just key with another vlog. <sighs> Until next time. Until next time. Right. This man been my brother took the fire to the cover uh could tell us about different fathers different mothers we got cars smoking we we try to hide the shit but we like Swiss and DMX we rough right